American Jewish Cuisine, Wikipedia Article Audio American Jewish cuisine comprises the food, cooking, and dining customs associated with American Jews. It was heavily influenced by the cuisine of Jewish immigrants who came to the United States from Eastern Europe around the turn of the 20th century. It was further developed in unique ways by the immigrants and their descendants, especially in New York City and other large metropolitan areas of the northeastern U.S. Between 1881 and 1921, around 2.5 million Jews immigrated to the United States from Eastern Europe. Most of them settled in large cities in the northeastern part of the country, especially New York, Philadelphia, Boston, Baltimore, and Chicago. These immigrants brought with them a well-developed culinary heritage. The cuisine continued to evolve in America, in the homes of the immigrants and their descendants, and in delicatessens and appetizing stores in New York City and elsewhere. History Kosher Food Delicatessens were quite popular among second-generation American Jews, especially in the mid-20th century. They provided a place for the patrons to socialize in a comfortable environment. They also popularized some of the dishes now associated with American Jewish cuisine, which were affordable for their upwardly mobile customers, but which would have seemed luxurious to their European ancestors. Though not as numerous as they once were, delicatessens continue to be popular dining destinations. Kosher food is food that conforms to kashrut, i.e. Jewish dietary laws. Under these rules, some foods for example, pork and shellfish are forbidden. Any meat must come from an animal that was slaughtered using a process known as shechita. Jewish dietary law also prohibits the eating of meat and milk at the same meal. For this purpose, Meat means the flesh of mammals and birds, and milk includes dairy products such as cheese and butter. Thus a kosher delicatessen selling corned beef sandwiches would not have any cheese, and a kosher bakery selling bagels and cream cheese would not have any meat. Many foods are classified as parave neither meat nor milk, and therefore acceptable at any meal. Parave foods include fish eggs, honey, and any edible plant. Kosher commercial establishments must be closed from Friday evening to Saturday evening, during the Jewish Sabbath. American Jewish cuisine may or may not be kosher. For example, some delicatessens follow Jewish dietary law in the preparation and serving of food, while others do not. Followers of Orthodox Judaism, the most traditional form of Judaism, generally eat only kosher food. Some other more observant Jews also eat kosher food most or all of the time. However the majority of American Jews are less observant of traditional rules, and eat non-kosher food. According to a 2012 study by the Pew Research Center, 22% of American Jews keep kosher in their homes. Kosher-style food is food that is made in the style of kosher food but that does not necessarily conform to Jewish dietary laws. For example, a kosher-style hot dog is an all-beef hot dog that is mildly spiced with garlic and other flavorings, and a kosher-style pickle is a sour pickle aged in brine with garlic and dill. The term kosher style may also refer to American Jewish cuisine in general. During the annual eight-day Passover holiday, Jews who are more traditionally observant do not eat leavened bread. During Passover some American Jews eat matzah and other foods that conform to this restriction. Kosher Style Food American Jews, like Jews elsewhere in the world, often participate in a Seder at the beginning of Passover. 
This is a ritual meal that includes the telling of the story of Passover the exodus of the Jews from Egypt. At a Seder, the Seder plate is a plate with special food items that are symbolic of different aspects of Passover. Around 90% of American Jews are Ashkenazi Jews, whose ancestors came from Eastern or Central Europe, where many of them spoke Yiddish as their first language. The foods commonly associated with American Jewish cuisine therefore have their origins in Russia, Poland, Ukraine, Romania, Hungary, Lithuania, Austria, and Germany. The United States also has a sizable population of Sephardic Jews, whose ancestors lived in Spain or Portugal, and later in other Mediterranean areas, and Mizrahi Jews, whose ancestors lived in the Middle East or North Africa. Sephardic and Mizrahi Jews have their own distinct cuisines, which, like Ashkenazi cuisine, were heavily influenced by their places of origin. Examples of significant Sephardic and Mizrahi communities across America include the Persian Jews of Los Angeles, the Moroccan Jews of Manhattan, the Turkish Jews of Seattle, and the Syrian Jews of Brooklyn. Additionally, Mizrahi and Sephardic cuisine predominates in the modern state of Israel. Therefore, Middle Eastern and Mediterranean dishes such as falafel, hummus, couscous, and shukshauka are also part of American Jewish cuisine. Passover The two largest groups of Eastern European Jews were Litvaks, who lived farther to the north and east, in the area of Lithuania, and Galicianers, who lived farther to the south and west, in the area of Galicia. Each group spoke their own dialect of Yiddish. According to some writers, it is sometimes possible to guess the ancestry of an American Jew by knowing their preferred style of gefilte fish. Litvaks ate gefilte fish that was flavored with salt and pepper, while Galicianers preferred theirs to be sweeter. The border between the areas where Litvaks and Galicianers lived has therefore been referred to as the Gefilte Fish Line. Popular dishes in American Jewish cuisine include Chopped liver Ashkenazi, Sephardic, and Mizrahi cuisine A Lotka Litvaks and Galicianers a pastrami on rye with kosher dill pickles and spicy brown mustard. Popular dishes and foods. Blackberry rugelach. Notable American Jewish restaurants, delicatessens, grocery stores, and food companies include. Commercial establishments. The American Jewish custom of eating at Chinese restaurants on Christmas Day or Christmas Eve is a common stereotype portrayed in film and television, but it has a factual basis. The tradition may have arisen from the lack of other open restaurants on Christmas, as well as the close proximity to each other of Jewish and Chinese immigrants in New York City. Dining at Chinese Restaurants on Christmas Bagel a donut-shaped bread roll. The dough is first boiled and then baked, resulting in a dense, chewy interior with a browned exterior. A bagel and cream cheese is a popular pairing. 